Why you may have to rethink that squid game costume for Halloween. Stores are reporting backlogs as they try to meet demand for the holiday. This is just the latest problem from the breaks in the supply chain. ABC's Deirdre Bolton is here with more. Good morning, Deirdre. Good morning, Lindsay. Americans are forecast to spend a record amount on Halloween this year. But when it comes to shopping for costumes, revelers may face empty shelves. It's Halloween time. That means ghosts, goblins, and witches, but there's a more frightening concept this year. The scariest thing is empty shelves. For college student Christopher Stott, the stores near the University of Lynchburg didn't have a lot. Basically all the stores up there and everything are out of everything and you can't really find a whole lot of options to choose from. He drove back to his hometown three hours to get his costume. There's all kinds of issues up and down the supply chain. Any sort of delay just cascades. We are starting to run out of our best selling lines. For shop owners and customers alike, that means unique challenges fueled by the broken global supply chain crisis that's leaving ships piling up in ports and fewer truckers on the road. Americans are expected to spend a record $10 billion on Halloween this year, with more than $3 billion of that on costumes alone. This has truly been a scary year, and uh, we're fortunate that we're a small business and we were able to get, uh, use our resources domestically and get everything in, but it was uh, nail-biting, literally. Top costumes for kids this year, superheroes always, and for adults, vampire, witch, ghost. One expert telling me these costumes are so popular because it's easy to eat and drink in. Victor. Priorities. You exactly. got that right, dear. Yep. Thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.